it is do or die time for Ethereum. If the bulls don't show up here, we're gonna head down to lower levels. Let's get into the charts. Trading. I am your host, JT, and here on the channel, we focus on Bitcoin fundamental and technical analysis, as well as some analysis on some of the alts. So in today's video, we're going to be going over the Ethereum chart, what I'm seeing on Ethereum. Are we able to actually get out of this very long and drawn out Ethereum bear market? And are we finally getting to the point where we can see Ethereum begin to outperform Bitcoin? It hasn't outperformed Bitcoin for the entirety of the bull market. So let's take a look at the charts and see what we can see. We're going to start things off on the daily chart, taking a look at uh, Ethereum here. Uh, we are at the point where the bulls really need to show up. If we lose this level, we're probably going to come down and test potentially even the $2,100 level. Currently sitting at a price of uh, just under, just shy of $3,000, we could get a nice little haircut, which would be a total retracement in Ethereum of around 46%, which in an altcoin, that's totally normal. If you're new to trading cryptocurrency, you need to understand that uh, these things are volatile. Everybody comes here for the volatility, but they never seem to consider that the volatility can also apply to the downside. I'm not seeing anything in the charts that are indicating that we have completed a price cycle. We're just at a consolidation phase. There's usually two major bull markets in the macro uh, bull market. So you'll get you know, an early phase where you don't have a ton of new participants, but everybody who's already in crypto is beginning to see the bull market kick off. Then you get a secondary phase where new money comes in. That's the exciting part of the market. You get all this new liquidity coming in and it's a hard bid and you get uh, really high prices. So yeah, like I said, really critical line in the sand. If we lose this 3K level, we'll probably head down to the 2K level, which is not what everybody wants to hear, but you know, th this is the line in the sand. If we bounce from this area, and if we take out this high at around uh, 3,600, I think that would be a really positive sign for the bulls. And uh, that would correlate with a move in Bitcoin breaking over the $67,000 level. So if we see Bitcoin above 67,000, I think we can assume that that, uh, Ethereum is preparing to do a rally. Now, if we take a look at the Ethereum chart on the Bitcoin comparative, let's just go over the candle charts and check out the weekly. You know, we've been calling this distribution for a very, very long time, years in fact, we've been calling this distribution. Um, this downtrend, it's a little, it's a little loud and noisy here. The important thing to note is this downtrend right here. This line has not been broken. We got a little bit of a breakout fake out right here, but it got quickly rejected. Um, worst case scenario, worst case scenario for Ethereum would be a retracement back down to 3 million sats per ETH, currently sitting at just under 5 million sats per ETH. I'm not saying that the highest probability is for us to come down to that level, but uh, in the event that the market takes a downwards turn, uh, Ethereum is very weak when compared to Bitcoin. So if Bitcoin takes another dump down to 50K, I would not be surprised to see Ethereum down at around 3 million sats per ETH. Uh, the point at which we break this downtrend, though, is the point at which the full altcoin season will be started. I think that uh, altcoin season has been very hit and miss thus far. We haven't seen the full-blown mania altcoin season. If we can get Ethereum up above that downtrend, that downward sloping line of resistance, I think that's going to kick off phase two of the bull market. That's going to kick off the mania phase. And you're going to see your whole portfolio glowing with green every day for the next, you know, six to eight months. So that's it. I just wanted to give you guys a quick update on my thoughts for Ethereum. Let me know in the comment section down below. Do you agree? Do you think we're going to, do you think we're going to hit 3 million sats per ETH? I think that could be a legendary buying opportunity for the Ethereum bulls out there. If you guys are interested in joining the trading group where we are sharing our entries, exits, take profits, stop losses, all of that information can be found down below in the Discord or you can scan the QR code popping up on the screen right now. If you're brand new to crypto trading and you're kind of, you know, getting chopped up here, I encourage you to uh, check out the Discord. Or if you're an intermediate trader that is, you know, seeing some success, you're getting some wins, but you're giving a lot of your wins back to the market, I encourage you to check things out and level up your game. That is all the time I have for today. If you guys enjoyed this content, please leave it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, please trade safe. It is a jungle out there. Peace.